There's some breaking news about Twitter. We now know who will take the helm at the social media company. Elon Musk tweeting that NBC Universal Global Advertising Chair Linda Yaccarino will take over the role as CEO of Twitter. Musk's tweet comes after a statement from NBC Universal confirming Yaccarino is leaving the company effective immediately. I should note NBC Universal is the parent company, of course, of NBC News and CNBC. CNBC senior media and tech correspondent Julia Borston has been following the Twitter story closely. She joins us now. Uh, Julia, we actually know Linda, or at least I do, know Linda Yaccarino. She works here. What do, what do we know about what role she's going to be taking on? Yes, that's well. Well, so as former head of global advertising and partnerships, Linda Yaccarino for NBC Universal. Linda Yaccarino built relationships with all of the biggest advertisers. She's She was at NBC Universal for a dozen years, and she really built this experience creating what they call the one platform at NBC Universal to deliver targeted ads and then measure results across both linear TV and then also NBC Universal content on digital platforms. So really building up that expertise there. She has the, I would say, better relationships in the advertising industry than anyone else you could think of. And Musk says she will focus, quote, on primarily on business operations while Musk focuses on what he says will be product design and new technology. Okay. So, Julie, what does that mean for Musk and his role? Because he's been acting as CEO, right? He has been acting as CEO, and I would say it is a big win for Musk, considering concerns about the Twitter's ad business. Remember that though Musk is trying to build a subscription business, right now Twitter is ad-supported. That's the primary source of its revenue. And there have been reports that many of the platform's biggest spenders pause spending or decrease their ad spending in the wake of Elon Musk taking over. And in fact, there's a firm called Insider Intelligence. They forecast that Twitter's global revenues will fall by t about 28 percent this year from last year. Back over to you. All right, Julia Borston for us. Thank you. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.